Hello everyone, today I'm making my burrowbos and jalapeno fried rice and I'm using my basmati speaker rice. Um, my ingredients is two jalapenos sliced, one red onion sliced, two cloves of garlic chopped up, a tablespoon of hot sauce, any hot sauce you like, two tablespoons of chutney, um, a sprig of thyme, 500 grams of burovos cut into pieces and about four four cups of cooked rice that's already cooked basmati rice strained and it must be cold okay and in the pan i've got like a tablespoon or two of olive oil and i've got a big fat knob of garlic and herb butter okay so I've listed the ingredients now to you. So my story for this dish is that Burovos is such a favorite in South Africa. It is, it is classic, classic, traditional South African um, cuisine. We love Burovos. We love sausage. And South Africa actually has the best sausage in my opinion. <laughs> So I had some leftover rice. I thought to myself, you know, let's put all these ingredients together and have just an amazing um, meal that doesn't take a lot of time and will please every person in the house. Okay. So now I'm gonna put first my sausage. I'm going to leave it just like that so it can just get a color on both sides. It already smells amazing. I'm just flipping over the sausage. Got a lick of color. Make sure I'm going to fry on both sides. Okay. Oh, liquor. Liquor, man. Liquor to the cracker. <laughs> okay. I'm happy with that. Give it some space so it can brown better. There we go. And it's important the stage where you brown the sausage. And it is on high heat so that you can get that extra very um, burovos crunchy um, flavor that comes out from the sausage itself. Okay, now I'm going to add the rest of the ingredients. My onion, my jalapeno, my garlic, my sprig of thyme. If you don't want the jalapeno to be extra strong, you can cut out the white parts and the seeds, or you can use green pepper or any sweet pepper if you don't want the spice. Smells amazing. And I forgot to add, also adding some salt to taste and pepper. Black pepper. Okay, 
Now I'm gonna add my sauce. I'm going to let this go for a few minutes, then I'm going to add my rice.
Okay, guys. So the final touches. Oh, this smells amazing. Oh. I made this last week for the family, and they insisted I must make it again. Okay, so what I do is, it's the same thing I did last week. Okay. Put some baby tomatoes. So what happens is, just before you serve it, you stir all this together. So you have the freshness of the tomato. So I'm going to put Yeah. I'm going to switch off the heat. It was on low for a little bit. Then some baby spinach. And lemon. Look at that. <laughs> so just when you before you serve. You take the lemon, squeeze it over, give it a stir, and then the meal is done. The whole base. Wait, I'd rather take the camera. Let me see a mark. There we go. Lovely. My purovos and jalapeno stir fried rice. Easy peasy and absolutely delicious hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as i did making it and i'll be back again with another video soon bye everyone love you guys <laughs>